Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Maria from Under the Night Moon, and I'm here today to show off our fancy, sassy little purple book that we um, started the other day in my first Craft With Me video. And of course I had to finish it and add it to this collection because I just absolutely adore this purple um, collection from Debrina over there at Pixie Dust Files. And to me, this paper is so inspiring, and I just love it. I love the lavender. I love the purple. It always just freshens up everything and adds a bright new... I don't know how to explain it, but I just love, love, love. So this is my second little purple book that I've made. Of course, I'll put links down below um, to the paper collection that I used and also a link to this little book that's going in my Etsy shop today. Um, and you can see in the Craft With Me video, we sort of put half of it together. Um, so the velvet trim, it's one signature. The open spine technique, which is how I showed you in the book using um, Ruby and Pearl's method actually. Um, two little bows here, and then I added, um, this is, I added some things since the video, so I'll show you, um, this beautiful rhinestone jewelry piece. I added this gorgeous, um, sequin netting, and to me that just has so much character, so much personality, and it looks like something that she would wear. Um, and I was explaining my book's have a theme and a mood to them sort of and so everything always goes back to um the character or the, like the main theme of the book which would be this lady and when I saw this lace I thought for sure that that would be something that she would have had on a dress or a hat um so of course I had to add that um I did add some rhinestones along the top for fun a little wax seal of a crown down here on the bottom and then some velvet and some flowers. Um, this also has pom-pom trim, this beautiful embroidered lace on the cover. This will also have a purple ribbon holding it together. Um, inside on the cover, you can see the gorgeous papers that the kit comes with. And I lined the back cover and the front cover with. And then she has a collection of florals. It is um, the, um, okay, I had it written down, but it's the Language of Flowers collection. I will link it down below so you can see. I think these florals match her purple collection so beautifully. So I gave you two of the tags. And I always think these books would be such a fun place for you to, um, and I'm going to show you here real quick, to create. Now, these all come with the Purple Passion Kit in the Pixie Dust Files, but these books, for me, create beautiful, <laughs> wonderful, magical moments to cherish. And... As I was cutting those out, I was repeating these words, make such a beautiful sentence. And so that's exactly right. That's just, just create these beautiful, magical moments in your life. And then you have a place to catalog them. And how pretty to hand this little book down, right? Or just have fun with it, a place for you to um, have fun writing down your thoughts, favorite music, recipes. Um, I always like to add the sewing theme, little snippets of textiles, dresses, um, things to inspire you, gorgeous papers, um, anything to just add some beauty to your, to your everyday life. Um, some backing papers, this comes with her kit also, this beautiful ballerina. And her digitals are so thoughtful. She's holding this gorgeous bunch of flowers. Her dress has embroidered roses on it. She's got this gorgeous background typography and then little lace accents on the top and bottom. So all of that going on in that one digital is so beautiful. If you look closely, you see all of her little um, details. That's what makes her digital so magical. 
and they print beautifully. Um, here's some plain ledger paper for you to journal on. Um, I added this gorgeous printed textile paper here. I did add a beautiful vintage image, a little teacup, and then hanging off the teacup, I made a little charm using a little porcelain or a little ceramic bead that's got a purple rose on it, and then a little glass purple bead below. And on the other side, um, this was the one that we created in the craft with me. Um, fun little Marie Antoinette. Beautiful floral from the collection. The colors are so vibrant, so pretty. We gave Marie dreams, I think. Yes. And then I did decorate. And what I love from the little charm on the other side is that it decorates this side. And this is just some embroidered vintage tool that I had. Some pretty sequins and beads in it. Just decorate this little piece also. And I just think that came out so feminine, so pretty. Of course, Marie, you know, we always like to decorate her up. And there we go. Um, I did add a little piece of some, uh, this is modern lace, but it just pairs so well with vintage. Gorgeous, gorgeous vintage wallpaper here. And there's where our little butterfly landed. So pretty. Uh, other side I left blank for you to write on. And then this has just got some textiles, this really fun silver silk which you'll see another piece of that coming up. My favorite little boot. Place for you to write. Other side of that gorgeous paper. This is one signature sewn in, or not sewn, it's tied in. And you can see here's how we tied it right here. Um, if you want to learn how I made this book, I'll link the video below um, so you can watch um, how I made this little book here. Super fun. Um, lots of pa uh, papers for you to write. Um, this we made a little pocket holding the This Journal Belongs to You card. A little aqua perfume label. And then I decorated this little fan um, with a, a, a seam binding ribbon. This is a little enamel charm of a bow. It's very delicate. It's very sweet. And it just hangs ever so quietly, like inside the bow here. It's like a little hidden gem. Love it, love it. And then my fun little, I don't even know what those are called, but I love them, <laughs> is a trim, like a dangly kind of trim. Love the way this page came out. So pretty, so feminine. And yeah, the other side we decorated um here's some beautiful cards and papers for you to journal your story on a little um word from the collection to inspire hopefully my little video inspired you to create a journal maybe have fun with some textiles um you don't need big pieces you know um just uh, the littlest pieces can brighten up and i'll show you exactly like this little silver piece of silk I thought would be so fun with the roots because that's where the magic happens, right? The, the plants grow from the roots. So pretty. So that was what I was thinking there. I am a nature lover. Um, if you don't know me, I absolutely adore nature, animals. Um, I'm really having fun on Instagram. I kind of joined Instagram late. And um, I really am enjoying all of the animal channels on Instagram. Here's a little tuck here. Um, there are so many. There's the cats of Instagram. There's beautiful dogs. There's little squirrels, raccoons, foxes. Um, oh my gosh, I am, I am loving all the animals on Instagram. I kind of wish... I joined Instagram late, so I feel like I've missed out, but um, it's so much fun, yeah. Anyway, you can see here just some beautiful papers, perfume labels. Um, this is a gorgeous printable from her shop, and I just added it to the back page. Just a fun little place for you to tuck away. Um, just pictures. Did I put anything in there? I don't know. No, but um, pictures, 
it's a nice full page pocket here. So you can add pictures, remnants, things that you've collected, maybe a little, you know, birthday card that you want to keep. Um, yeah, this is why I make these books. It's a place for you to store um, all of your special um, things. You know, I love giving you a place to put them. Uh, so here in the video, I had made this pocket and then I just... Um, I love to finish off my edges and corners, so I just added a, pre uh, ah, a piece of this gorgeous velvet, little pearl accent there. I did do a wax seal of a cameo up here. Uh, sweet little image there. Um, just to um, end our fun little sassy purple um, book for you. And I really hope you enjoy uh, the craft with me video and also watching this video um, I absolutely love this little book so I'm so happy um, and I'm going to be making more of these because I just love the purple is such a beautiful color it's so fresh and inspiring and um, yeah so um, listings will all be um, in my Etsy shop this afternoon. They will be linked below. Um, but just mostly, thank you so much for watching, following me here and on Instagram, and of course my Etsy shop if you're there. Um, happy Sunday, and just thank you all so, so much. Um, I appreciate you all and your support, and I'm just super grateful and blessed. So thank you, thank you, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.